Today, we're checking out two of the best Stickman tournaments I could find on YouTube. Stickman Tourney Round 1, Fire vs. Stick. I personally think that Fire is going to win the entire tournament, dude. How are you going to beat Flames? No way. Oh, okay. All right. All, uh, already, Fire has won his first match. Very interesting. Okay, round number two, Dagger versus Spear. So a lot of people in the comments of this video were saying that uh, a lot of the, the stick figures, they're like weapon specialists, but there are a lot of different uh, like elemental guys, kind of like the red guy is the fire guy. And it looks like Spear wins round number two. Round number three is Shield versus Glove. Yeah, a lot of the Stickman tournaments that I see, like, they fight to the death. This one's a little bit different. This one, they're kind of like, it's a normal tournament style where, yeah, as soon as you, like, disarm your enemy, then you win. So it's actually more realistic, I feel like, than a lot of the other animations where they literally battle until one person can barely stand. Uh, round number four, Anchor versus Sword. Oh, my goodness. Whoa. Okay, man, that Anchor ability is pretty sweet. Good way to disarm me. You win. Wow, that was it. These are the fastest stick people fights. Winner is sword. Holy smoke. Sometimes these battles go on for like minutes on end from what I've seen, but these ones are quick. Archer versus, I don't even know what that was. Does he have telekinesis or like smoke clouds? Maybe he's an airbender. Oh, cool. By the way, if you guys haven't already, comment down below who you think is going to win. And I know some of you guys do this, but if you can help yourself, don't go into the end and then look who actually wins and then comment that person. Just actually make a prediction. I know you guys. You guys are cheaters. Oh, okay. So far, so good. Whoa. Okay, can you put me down? <laughs> Winner is Stretch. Yo, that's Miss Fantastic right there. What is this? Or oh, sorry, Mrs. Incredible. Two Spears versus Hook. Okay, the Hook ability is very similar to the Anchor ability. I guess just a little bit different. He kind of has like a fishing hook. Wow, so when these guys get disarmed, I feel like that's it. Yeah, you can literally just stab it and then you win. Winner is two spears. I don't know, man. I feel like the fire guy, he's going to do too much damage. He's not going to be able to to uh, destroy maybe the water guy. I feel like the water guy might be the only problem for the fire guy that we saw at the beginning of today's video. But like, I don't know, dude. It doesn't seem like the weapon specialists are going to be able to fight against the elemental guys. It's like... It's like people that bring a knife to a gunfight. It's just, you're going to lose every time. Fire or spear. Okay, no, this is over. Dude, you could literally burn it. Oh, you can't burn it. Oh, no. No. Oh, come on. Come on, just burn past the, the spear. Okay, at least he has some other abilities, too. He's not just like a one-trick pony. He can actually do other things. Look at that. <laughs> he played himself. He stabbed the wall, and then he lost his own spear. Round number 10, glove versus sword. Mm, I don't know. I think the gloves might be able to grab the sword and pull it away. Let's see what happens here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There it is. Too easy, bro. Winner is glove. Next up, who do we got? Let's see. Bubble versus stretch. I think stretch, he can go straight through the bubbles, right? Or he can even pop them. Oh, wow. Wow. Yeah, guys. Oh, okay. Uh, how do they... What just... <laughs> he didn't want to get beat up, so he was like, "I that's it. I don't want to fight anymore. Next up, two spears versus water. Again, I still feel like, yeah, the elemental guys are too OP. <laughs> He's picking them up and putting them down in a giant ball of water. I'm done. <laughs> nah, dude, that, that's too OP. It's going to be fire versus water at the end. I'm calling it now. Fire and glove. Okay, yeah. Once again, dude, the glove guy, I mean, it seems like a cool ability, but he needs to be able to do more. He needs to be able to, like, move the gloves or, yeah, something. It literally, he gave up. He didn't want to get burned. Okay, this is it. Semifinals. Stretch versus water. Again, I feel like water has this in the bag. Yeah, stretch can go through the water, but this move is OP. He could pick him up and put him down. He could also just, like, drown him, right? He can cover the entire area with water if he really wanted to. Oh, what? wait a second. Wait a second. Wait, Stretch is actually looking pretty good. Oh, whoa, that's too big. Oh, <laughs> just want to shake your hand. <laughs> I love how they're so, like, gentlemanly about it. They're like, all right, that's it. I'm going to lose. I don't feel like dying today. And they're just like, all right, cool. We're going to shake on it. Okay, this is it, the finals. Fire versus water. 
Who will win? Who will die? Or not necessarily die, because they're not really fighting to the death. But I, I don't know, man. Water is super effective against fire. Fire has trouble against water. I mean, water literally puts out fire. So I don't know, guys. I didn't realize water was a, a, an ability when I first picked fire. I got to stick with fire, though. Come on. You can do this. Oh, whoa. The last battle is turning out to be pretty epic. Whoa. Dude, the animator is going crazy right now. Whoa. Oh, oh, come on. Yes. Yes. No, 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 no. Oh, that's not good. No, boys. No. Please, fire. Come on. Burn the water. Evaporate him. I miss again, huh? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I had a feeling this might happen. All right, you got me. Winner is water. Wow, water is the champion. They actually made a second one that's supposedly even better. So let's see. Okay, we have all of the colors at the bottom. Let's see who we think is going to win. I'm going to go with orange. I have no idea what orange's ability is, but I'm just going to lock it in and we're going to see how we do. First up, round one, Scythe versus Twins. Okay, so we have some new abilities here. Mm, all right, Mr. Grim Reaper. Well, Twins is a little bit OP. They, they need to kill both of the Twins if they're... Maybe not kill them, but like, you know, make both of the Twins forfeit if they want to win. Oh, <laughs> that's not even fair. <laughs> they <laughs> held him down, bro. Oh, that's so funny. What is next? We have vehicle versus knife. The vehicle is going to destroy the knife. What's the vehicle? Oh, he's got a motorcycle. Oh, oh, wait. Oh, okay. Interesting. So he can use the vehicle as a shield and he can just summon in any vehicle. Not even just the one vehicle. Okay. He needs something bigger. Maybe like a rocket ship. Oh, maybe a plane. Oh, he threw the knife. <laughs> oh, wait, it has guns. Oh my god! Okay, a helicopter with a rocket? This guy not only has vehicles, he has military vehicles. Nice vehicles. You win. Thank you. Winner, vehicle. I mean, we all saw that coming, right? There is no way that the vehicle guy was not going to win. Round number three is flying versus sound. Hmm. And I think sound. I mean, flying is cool, but I, if that's your only ability, like, what are you gonna do? I guess you could pick them up and, like, drop them from a high height, but they are kind of locked into this tiny box. So, I don't know, man. Sound seems kind of OP, especially, like, you can crack somebody's eardrums if you really go hard enough. Oh, no, yeah, look at that. He's getting worked down. <laughs> Stop! You win, man. I'm tired. I'm just gonna lie here. All right, thanks, then. Sure thing. <laughs> Winner is sound. Nice. I call that. Next up, wings versus electricity. Ooh, okay, okay, look at him go. Yeah, yeah, he's like a giant bat. A bat stick man, okay, okay. Electricity, I mean, I feel like, yep, 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 yep. Electricity's gonna be able to dwindle away all of those wings. Turns out they're not even like actual wings. They're like robot wings. <laughs> well, my wings are broken. <laughs> you win against me. All right, man. <laughs> That's what I'm saying, guys. The elemental dudes that can literally summon in elements are too OP because you can't take that away from them. Whip versus invisible. Okay, invisible wins. Where did he go? I'm here. <laughs> oh, no, now he's invisible again. Wait, couldn't the whip dude just like spin around in a circle and then you would hit him wherever he's going? Well, hello there. Ah, miss me. <laughs> this isn't fair. Oh, bro. Oh, this isn't fair at all. He literally stole the whip. Oh, gosh. And he tied him up. Well, my friend, you caught me. You are the winner. Thanks. Winner, invisible. That makes sense. I think that we all saw that one coming. Next up is ball versus quick movement. Hmm. What's the... What, what are you going to do with the, the ball? Oh, wow. Okay. Slow... Oh, wow. Okay. Yup. This is a horrible matchup for the dodgeball man. Slow motion can do whatever he wants with the ball. <laughs> I give up. <laughs> oh my god, dude. I love when they give up super quick. It's just, it's so anticlimactic that it's actually funny. Next up, nature versus guns. I like this matchup. For some reason, I think nature's gonna win. 
Oh, whoa, oh, whoa, okay. He can summon in multiple guns. It's kind of similar to the vehicle guy, but the nature dude can summon in giant trees. And maybe even, like, flesh-eating plants. Like the Vetus flytrap. Well, uh, see, look, I, I don't know why nature was going to win that. I just felt it. Multiplier versus spike. Okay, so multiplier is kind of like twin, but on steroids. Oh, how many times can you multiply? That's the real question. Oh. Oh. Oh my gosh, he has a shadow clone jutsu. Whoa. Whoa. Okay, all right. If he can do all of that ability, if he can, like, summon in spikes all over his body, I don't... You guys beat me. I feel like he could have won. If he worked hard enough and had some uh, some dedication, he probably could have won that. Well, next up, we're going into the quarterfinals. Twin versus vehicle. Vehicle. Come on. Come on. Unless the twins steal the vehicle somehow, but the vehicle guy can summon them in and then also unsummon them. So there's no way he loses. Just, just get into your attack helicopter or a tank and yeah, just destroy them. Oh, no. Oh, that's not good. Oh, oh, there we go. Come on, boys. Uh, are you kidding me? Okay, the vehicle guy, he's kind of garbage. I surrender. Really? Good work, team. Are you joking me? No. Nah, guys, I don't believe that for one, one second. There's, I, if I had the vehicle ability and I lost to a set of twins, I would be so mad at myself. Next up, sound versus electricity. Ooh. I think sound. Yeah, sound, for whatever reason, seems a little bit overpowered. Yeah, as long as you keep working them down with sound, it should be fine. Yeah. Yeah, come... That was awesome, by the way. I resigned... No! You defeated me? They, like, barely even fight! Ah, I wish that they, like, went more crazy. And they, they actually did, like, some crazy combat. Which I think we're gonna get for the finale. Kind of similar to that last video. Let's see. Invisible versus quick movement. Oh, where is he? Hello. Hi. <laughs> this one's interesting. Behind you. I know. He can slow down time, which makes him like go really fast. So we can like test out pretty much every area until he finds him. But all right. Where are you? Yeah. I'm, oh, he was on the wall. You know what? This fight is pointless. You are the winner. <laughs> winner. Invisible. That is one way to beat your enemies, ladies and gentlemen, is to just wait them out. Round number 12, nature versus multiplier. I think nature wins again, especially if nature can summon in like some minions. Let's see, nature can do like a, a crazy thorn bush or yeah, just like vines that destroy all of the multipliers. Mm, so far it seems pretty good. Yep, there you go. Yeah, multiplier is gonna have to give up sooner or later. He can multiply all he wants, but eventually he's going to get tired, right? Uh-oh. Great job, everyone. Thanks. No! Really? All they had to do was hold him down? He could have summoned in a Venus flytrap. Round number 13, semifinals. Twin versus electricity. Hmm. Well, I didn't think the twins would make it this far, so... I still don't think they're going to make it that far. We're going electricity! These elemental guys, there's no way they get beat by just two normal twins. They don't even have special powers. It's literally just twins. Yes. Oh, it's over. Look at this. That is epic. Okay, you got us, man. You win this round. Well, okay, so electricity, he's looking like the favorite right now. I don't know how any of the other powers are going to be able to put up with electricity. Let's see. Invisible versus multiplier. I'm going to be kind of disappointed if Invisible wins. I mean, it's a cool power, but I feel like Electricity could just shoot anywhere and then somehow hit Electricity. Or, sorry, Invisible. Huh. Okay. Oh, okay. That is overpowered. That is stupidly overpowered. Nice. Thanks. And, ladies and gentlemen, we have our finale. It's going to be Multiplier versus Electricity. Please tell me electricity wins this. I have just a good feeling about it. All right. Here goes nothing, boys. Whoa! Okay, just shoot them all. Yeah, just keep summoning in electricity. Yes. Yes! No, 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 no. It's, it's, uh, that's fine. That's fine. He's got this. He's surrounded, but it's fine. He has electricity power. 
And also, apparently, he's a kung fu master. Just do like a Pikachu Thunderbolt. Come on. Yes. Yes! That's what I'm talking about right there. Booyah, baby! Who else is out there? Oh, it's still the last guy. But he could... How many guys can he summon in? This is such an OP ability. Charge! Oh, no. Whoa, what is that? Maybe that's how he uses his powers. He has an electricity whole arm. Yes! Oh! <laughs> I'm exhausted from running around over here. Well played, sir. Well played. Thank you. Winner electricity, ladies and gentlemen. I called it. Maybe not from the start, but... I did it, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, make sure you guys leave a like. Check out the original creator who will be linked down below. And while you're at it, click this video to see more Stickman tournaments.